So, uh, I'll, let me Google that. LMF stands for what in Twitch speak? Uh, uh, lazy MF, left arm medium fast, life music fun. I don't think either of those are correct. <laughs> Uh, wow. Are you calling me lazy? I don't think so. Shouldn't be. Oh, it is. Wow. Why are you calling me lazy? <laughs> what did I do to you, my guy? guy. I don't know what you want from me. <laughs> Is, uh, what's the word? Um, oh, that urban dictionary. Is that lying to me? <laughs> uh, jeez. Wait. Sorry guys, I'm 32 years old and I am not hip with the lingo, apparently. <laughs> Moving on. Uh, we were to reconvene with the others in front of Megaduta, would we not? That should be just outside. With any luck, they will have already returned from their own investigations. My friend, we must take our leave. I pray that your establishment is spared further tragedy. But remember, your lives are far more precious than anywhere's. If you are ordered to flee, do so without hesitation. Indeed, thank you for your concern, and pray you to take care as well. Uh, how on earth do I get to there? I think this is the right path. See, the good news is, while I'm doing this on live, when I cut this stream up and show it off on a tutorial video, you'll know exactly the path to take the right for the first time. <laughs> You're welcome. of this. Please don't all just give it to despair and turn into beasties. Ah, finish your rounds and ready to share. There you are. You've spoken with the survivors. Indeed. Tab since I don't have to read it. Uh, and then, yeah. Indeed. We thought to share what we have gleaned, that we might together gain a greater understanding of present circumstances. Circumstances. Fortuitous timing. Alize and I completed our own investigations not long ago. I'll just say hi. Then we should take a moment to compare notes. Shall we begin with the two of you? Maybe it's higher up in the back of the throat. I'm so American, I can't help myself. If I ain't talking with this here draw, it just ain't right. If you're gonna speak English in America, you better speak the right English, none of that hoity-toity English stuff. So the merchant Karzal was gravely concerned about his business in the days preceding his untimely end. That we put him to? <laughs> the tales we heard were much the same. The first victims to be changed into blasphemies were all overcome with anguish of one manner or another. 
Good thing it's then those who saw their loved ones stolen before their eyes succumbed to a similar panic, setting in motion a chain of transformations. Laundry day. Fear, unease, despair. These negative feelings serve as a catalyst. Indeed. If so, then it is not unlike the calamity that befell the ancients. With their creation magics, they unwittingly gave form to untold horrors. Had they simply lost control, surely it would have manifested in many forms, not all of them monstrous. Indeed. I bet it's the Yet EDM. somehow, this phenomenon is triggered solely by the darkness in their hearts. A common thread with what we now witness. I think... I think the way this gets justified, right? So the Heartless in um, Kingdom Hearts are just like this entity, right? That steal the hearts and souls of people and then turn them into the Heartless, right? And the zombie apocalypse, right? It's a virus that kills you and then reanimates your body, giving you only primal urges and instincts to feed. I think this, it, the Amarines, the Amartines, um, I think this manifestation of void, of ethereal void, is the uh, universal energetic balancing of their life magic. So, yin and yang, right? With with every time they use their life magic, it causes a dark void to manifest in the ethereal sphere. Now, granted, this is getting into slightly philosophical realms, but in terms of the energy spectrum, right? Energy be, can neither be uh, created nor destroyed. It can only be converted, right? That's what we fundamentally know in physics. Quantum physics t starts to make that a little bit more wibbly-wobbly, but fundamentally... You, like, if I were to rub my hands together, it would create heat, right? But I would also lose a few skin cells, and then once that heat is dissipated, that energy turns into whatever energy is called when, when you have just airflow, right? So, if instead I was casting magic, manifesting a spoon to appear, or, or Nutella, right, um, or whatever else, if I was causing, ca causing that to appear and manifest with my magic, there would have to be an equal and opposite effect being created at the same time. Just like antimatter, right? And the current uh, high-speed electron collider, when you create matter, you also create antimatter. And although the antimatter annihilates immediately, or almost immediately, it, it is still created at the same moment that the actual matter is created, right? So in this sense, the... Uh, life magic, if you will, is matter, and this void would be the antimatter, but it's two halves of the same coin. It's the, the energetic balance, if you will. And what's happening is that the void was never able to actually dissipate as such, because Zodiac was the, the keeper, the vessel, maybe, that uh, manifested or was somehow... The, the binding vessel, the electromagnetic capsule that kept the um, antimatter from exploding, right? Well, now that he's gone, the vessel is uh, ruptured, and now the void can leak out again until it achieves equilibrium, aether aetherically speaking. And I think that's what we're going to find out. Common, but not identical. While the beasts the ancients faced were forged with magic alone, those of today are born of sentient beings. I'm pretty sure they were born of sentient beings. Why remains too. to be seen. But there is one fundamental difference between us and our predecessors. Our souls are sundered, whereas theirs were not. Perhaps that single variable makes all the difference. Uh. If I may, there was another detail that troubled me. Sky. We have it on good authority that Karl Zahl's transformation took place before the skies began to burn. Literally. What? If that's true, then the situation's more dire than we realized. It means even if there's no ominous sign presaging the final days, anyone, 
anywhere has the potential to become a beast. Like that poor bastard in Ishgard. Even in lands we thought safe, even as we speak. Yep. Look! It's the Sartrap! At least I've been saying that word right. The Sartrap! Sartrap. Thank the heavens! My countrymen, I am relieved and heartened to see you strong and safe. While the danger has not yet passed, far from it, allow me to assure you that the beasts that raged within the city walls have been exterminated to the last. Yeah. Outside this sanctuary, the brave men and women of the Radiant Host and our dragon ally continue to battle our unholy foes. I pray these tidings put your minds at ease and help you calm your hearts. Have faith that we shall soon conquer this terrible trial. <laughs> yeah. Now's definitely the time not to insult Your them. Excellency, is there any word from Palaka's stand? My grandson was bound for there yesterday and I, I worry for his life. Lie to her. Lie to her right now. We are still awaiting a report. But I promise you, as soon as I have all to share... Lie to her. You... Your Excellency, I bring grave oh, news. No. Oh, this is gonna turn into a, a, a dungeon. You are? <laughs> I, I'm Matya of, of Akali, a humble fisherman. Ah, I remember you from our first visit. Uh huh? Wait, you're. But. But no! That can wait. When the skies turned red, I set off for Palakistan, stand, fearing for the safety of a friend. But as I drew near the village, I oh, saw no. dreadful beasts all about. Oh no! Gods have mercy! No! Your Excellency, save my grandson, I beg of you. First of all, her outfit's on, on, on. on. We will spare no effort to save all we can, but you must remain calm. But calm? You tell that. me to be calm? You saw those beasts? They tore our bravest warriors limb from limb. Oh, the panic. Oh, no. What if we are too late, huh? Did they catch him? Sink their fangs oh, into him? Oh, no. The fangs? Oh no. <laughs> Get away from her. Now. Oh no. God, that's fucking awful. Imagine your kid is in the military and you are rightfully worried because we're in the middle of a war and then you just turn into that. This is awful! This expansion just rips your heart and soul to shreds. Like, it does not hold back. Damn it! The ravages We've of got war. to kill them before it spreads. Before it spreads? It's we'll already widespread. This. Panic. See the townspeople to safety. Yes! Those who aren't currently turning into beasts. Run as fast as you can! Hideous creature. No. That literally looks like an Eldritch Terror. Go. And now that's your son. That's his son. His son's soul just got. Oh my god! He just. Oh my god! Oh no. C 
seriously? Vitra, our people, you must save them. <laughs> oh my god! Sake and your own. Did you stop them? Is it possible? <gasps> yes. You will survive. You must. Jesus. Dude, this guy is going to be traumatized for life. I'm a little traumatized. <laughs> I could not imagine watching my son turn into a creature, then get crushed in the same breath. And then watch my fearless leader literally get his head bitten off like it was Attack on Titan. Good God. This expansion is fantastic and awful at the same time. Oh. Dude. Dude. What are you doing, Graha? What, what you got? How are you, what are you gonna do? You shall not pass. Be strong, my friends. This is where we hold Fear them! Fear not, for we will defeat these abominations! This is where they die! To arms! Brave men and women of the Radiant Host, lend your Stola and Thancred your aid. Let not a single beast escape. The rest of you, flee this place. Carry the wounded if you oh must. My God. Head indoors or underground. Grahatia. God. Above all, stay calm. No beast will follow you. We will see to that. We will hold the line. To the last. With our last breath. Alphano! Alize! Leave the city to us! And make for Palika's stand at once! Matsya, show my friends to the village! I promise you, they're more capable than the host's finest! Jesus. R right. I don't know. Is Alpha now more Go capable? with them, will you? No. Why would I We will them? save these people. As many as we can. Alpha now won't even heal me as a tank. Okay. My respect level for Graha went from I don't give a damn about the character from, and then like marginally impressed in Shadowbringers to right up there with Ishtola and Alice in terms of combat, like. Grahatia just is the MVP right now. He just came out and was like, people, my fellow countrymen, we, the people, shall and must defend. Oh, that was hype. I, that was hype, not gonna lie. Damn it all! Staying calm isn't exactly my forte, but at least anger isn't going to be translated into despair. We meet again. You you do remember me, yes? You saved my skin twice over at Yetlamad, and now I find myself turning to your help for once more. But let us stay here no longer. Well, I gotta be a tank. That, uh, that has to happen. We must save Palakistan, whatever it takes. Matsya, it pains me to put you into harm's way, but I would ask you aid as well. Uh, of course, Palaka stand is not far, just down that hill. But as I told His Excellency before, that path was blocked by terrible creatures. I have no choice but to turn back. Well, you got a tank, a DPS, and a healer, so you should be good. In that case, this is what we shall do. Saganoft, I ask that you take the lead and dispatch any beasts you encounter. I'll say now I will keep Matsya hidden amongst the trees and follow when the path is clear. Alright, I'm gonna become a summoner then. 
There is no telling what dangers await us. Keep your eyes peeled. Good God. I, my heart is racing, guys. Like, I am... Like, I got some feelings and some adrenaline going right now. Like, this is nuts. Like, bruh. I... People are dying. The Satra... This is like Game of Thrones. Almost. Like, Game of Thrones meets Lord of the Rings meets every Final Fantasy franchise thrown in one. With, like, Eldritch Terrors. For, for good, good measure. Whoops. Stop it. Wrong, wrong button! I don't know how to play a summoner that well. It's a good thing it's OP. Oh, good with those instant casts. Please, more of that. Alright, next one. Moving right along. We're gonna fight as if this is the true sense of urgency. Like, we, if we don't make it there, like, this game is over. Like, we have seconds, minutes, before shit hits the fan. That's the sense of urgency I'm gonna play this, this match. I'm gonna pretend that I actually know how to play this class. We got this, we got this, we got this, we got this. We, we got, uh, we do not have the time to be dicking around, folks. Uh, there are baddies that need to die. Alright, give us instant. Nope, all past it. Alright. Alright, keep going, keep going, keep going. We got this, we got this. Knock it out, knock it out. Alright, we're good. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, you know what, let's mount up. Screw it. Oh, we're friggin' moving right along. Alright. Oh, wh why the hell didn't we just... Oh, there's hiding. Anyway. I am... I am... Tra traveling as fast as I can to save this place. Before it becomes Palika's last stand. What's happened to them? Don't want to know that. Good work, Sagenhoft, though I wear it for Matsya. All right, come on, let's see what's going on. I'm either gonna have to stay at DPS or I'm gonna have to go tank spec. But I imagine since we don't have Thank or Gratia, we're allowed to not have a tank. It, it cannot be. Well, are they turning or are they? Okay, they're dead. We must heal those we can and quickly. I see no beasts, but stay on your guard. Alright, so I'll become a scholar. Big bed, let's go. Let's get this. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Collapsed here. Let's go, let's go. Aiding. Oh my god. Cooling body begins to stiffen. It's awful. This lady's probably dead too. Jesus. It did... Who created, like, who was the scriptwriter for this? Are they trying to cause PTSD among the children who played this game? Like, oh my god. Though the villager's injuries do not appear to be life threatening, he does not respond to your efforts. His breathing grows more ragged and shallow, and his vacant eyes are those of a man who has lost the will to live. Even if I wake, the nightmare goes on. No, lead me to my sleep. Good lord! The, okay, just like gambling isn't appropriate for children, I'm pretty sure absolute despair and the dramas of war and apocalyptic, like, devastation is also not child appropriate. Like, even if you're a teenager, I don't think this is appropriate. I'm an adult and this isn't appropriate! Who am I kidding? Have you, have you come to Alphas? Too late, too late, my family, <laughs> my friends. Oh, I thought he was gonna turn right then and there. Dude, this place is gonna turn into an instance. I can see it. I can, I can taste it. Are these the only villagers who survived? I can only hope others managed to flee, but if the rest have been turned to beasts. By the twelve, 
Let us do what we can to see the damage spreads to no further. And no matter what comes, we must keep our spirits high, lest we ourselves suffer a similar fate. Well, I won't, because I have an echo. 